All right, Navy Electricity Electronic Training Series, Module 10, Introduction, Wave Propagation, Transmission Lines, and Antennas. Okay, um... Chapter 2, Radio Wave Propagation. All right. Learning objectives. Upon completion of this unit, you should be able to save the electronic field, what an electromagnetic field is, what the components make up of the electronic magnetic field, the difference between the induction field and the radiation field. See, state what radio waves are. Lay the component of the radio wave. Define the term cycle of the frequency harmonic period with the wavelength of the velocity that apply with the radio wave propagation. Compute the wavelength of the radio waves. Compute the wavelength of the radio waves. State how the radio waves are polarized vertically or horizontal. State whether reflection, refraction, diffraction is applied with the radio waves. State the influence of the atmospheric air. Earth's atmosphere on radio waves, list in the different layers of the Earth's atmosphere, and identify the ground wave, sky wave, the state effect of the ionosphere, ion sky wave, identify the structure of the ionosphere, um, identify the density of the layer frequency angle of the in 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 incidence, skip distance and skip zone, Drop the um, describe propagation paths, describe fading, multi fading. Multiple path fade and fading, multiple path fading, select fading, describe the propagation path, state the how the transmission law of the effective wave propagation, state how electromagnetic interference man made the natural interference with the ionic uh, ion sphere disturbances affect the radio wave propagation, state the how the transmission law of the effect the radio wave propagation, identify the variation of the ion sphere. Identify the maximum output lowest uh, usable frequency of the radio wave. State the temperature inversion of how frequency predictions are made and how weather affects the frequency. State the troposphere tri tri scatter is and how it affects the radio wave propagation. All right, electromagnetic field. The, the wave of the energy probably gave the free space to offer the great distribution among um, people with the concern with it. And although many of the theories have been proposed, the following theory adequately explains the phenomena has been widely accepted. These two basic fields are associated with every antenna and induction field, the radiation field, the field associated with the energy stored in the antennas is called the induction field. The state field is said to provide no part of the transmission electro, uh, is no part in the transmission electromagnetic field energy through the free space. However, there without appear the presence of the induction field, there would be no energy radiated. Induction field, figure 321, low frequency generated connected to an antenna will help you understand how the induction field is produced. Let's follow the generator through one cycle of the operation. Antenna generator, um, one hertz field, um, um, electrum voltage field, Ma um, uh, electric field, and magnetic field, electric field, um, magnetic field, electric field, induction field about the antenna. Initially, you consider the, uh, you consider, consider the generator output zero with no field exists for the, um, about the antenna and shown with you A with the no assume with the greater potential the slightly potential for the instantaneous polarity shown with you B with because of the slight potential for the antenna capacity acts as a short allowing the large flow of the current. Through the antenna direction, some of the current flow in the turn produced the large magnetic field about the uh, uh, about the antenna. Since the flow of the current each end of the antenna is minimum, with the corresponding magnetic field of the antenna is also at a are also minimum. At this time, passes charge of the output of the antenna current with the produced the electrostatic field, um, are called the uh, E field, collecting each of the end of the anten antenna. Eventually, the antenna capacitates the full charge of the top of the current flow. Through the antenna, under this condition, electrostatic field is maximum. The magnetic field, the A field, is fully collapsed and shown for you to see. As the generated potential decreases to the back to zero, the potential for the antenna give the bit, begins to discharge during the discharge path of the electrostatic field. The collapse of the direction of the current flow of the reverses is shown for you D. The current again begins to flow. The associated magnetic field generated with eventually the electrostatic field completely collapse. The generator potentially reverses the current and maximum shown for you E. The charge collected at the end of the antenna electrostatic field is produced current flow to decrease the cover of the magnetic field to begin, begin collapse. The collapsing of the the magnetic field produces the more current flow with the greater accumulation with the charge of the greater electrostatic field. The antenna gradually re reaches the condition shown view of F with the current zero of the collected charges at minimum. At the generator, again, decrease the zero of the antenna, but give it the discharge of the electrostatic field. Begins to collapse with the generator pull on potential reaches the zero of the discharge of the current maximum. The associated magnetic field is ma maximum. A brief time um, ladder grid um, generate, generator pull potential zero of the condition shown view B, B reoccurs. No, the electrostatic field and the electrostatic field, the electric field and electrostatic field are the same. They will be uh, used interchangeable throughout this text. This graph shown in Figure Two Two shows the relations between the magnetic field and the electro um, electric field um, plotted against the time. Note the two fields at 90 degrees off phase with each other. If you compare with the graph of the Figure Two Two to the Figure Two One, you will notice the two fields are around the antenna are displaced 90 degrees from each other and in space. The magnetic um, magnetic field. Exists in plane perpendicular to the antenna. The electric field exists in a plane parallel with the antenna shown in Figure Two One. Our Figure Two Two shows the phase relationship of the induction field components. Um, the expanding magnetic field and the electric um, um, expanding electrical field. 
All the energy supplied by the induction field is returned to the antenna collapsed within the electric and magnetic field with the no energy of the induction rate and field of the radiator is thrown the antenna. Therefore, the induction field of the conservative local field plays no part with the transmission electronic electromagnetic energy of the induction field represents only stored energy of the antenna represents only of the resonant effect of the antenna reflects the end to the generator. Radiation field. The electric and magnetic fields are set up by the transfer of energy with the space that's known to the collective of the radiation field. The radiation field is responsible for the electromagnetic radiation from the antenna, but the radiation field is accrued for the distance of the antenna and is accrued for the both. It's accrued for the linear radiation field reaching for the greater distance from the antenna. Look, look at half wave of the antenna to illustrate the radiation actually takes place. Simply stated, the half wave of the antenna is one with the electrical length that equal to the length of the single being transmitted. Assume for the example, the transmitter is operating 30 megahertz. The half wave of the antenna is the transmitter. The antenna's length, um, the electrical length would have to be at least 16 feet long with the form of the UV to compete with the electrical length of the antenna will be explained in chapter 4 when power is delivered to the halfway of the antenna both of the induction field and the radiation field are separate up and fluctuating energy at the energy the antenna the intensity of the field the portion portion of the amount of power delivered to the antenna short of the trans such as the transmitter short distance from the antenna beyond the only radiation field exists the radiation field is made up of the electrical component and a magnetic component with the right angles to each other in space the verifying together and in intensity with a high frequency generator transmitter connected with the antenna the induction field that is produced for the described of the previous section, however, the greater poten generator potential reverses before the electrostatic field has time to collapse with the completely reverse generator potential, even though it the remaining antenna charge for the leaving the resultant of the elect electric field in space. All right, for simple picture, electric field um, detaching itself on the antenna. That magnetic field will not be, um, be conservative through its present view. A of the voltage maximum electrical field has maximum intensity. Line of the force is being acted at the end of the, of the uh, at the end of the antenna is positively charged with extending to the only, uh, uh, standing to the end of the antenna is negatively charged. Note that the um, electric lines are stretched away from the inner line of the. This is because of the repelling force that takes place between the line of the forces of them in the same direction. Voltage drop of UB. Separated charges come together and ends with the lines moving toward the center of the antenna. But since the lines of the force same direction repel each other, the center of the lines are still being held out. All right, A shows the ma um, your magnetic um, maximum applied voltage, increase applied voltage, um, zero applied vol voltage applied, increase applied voltage. Notice it's separated um, radiation from an antenna. Um, as voltage approaches the zero of the, of the UB, with the sum of the line of the collapse back into the antenna, and at the same time, the end of the other together begin to come together with a form of a complete loop. Note that the direction of these lines forth the next to the antenna. You see that at the point of the voltage for the next antenna is zero, after the charge of the start of the bill of the opposite direction of UD, the electric lines of the force begin at the positive end of the antenna, strip the negative end of the antenna line of the force will begin with the same direction inside of the closed loop next to the antenna, repel the closed loops, and forth them into the space. In the speed of light, as the tra loop travels through space, the generated magnetic field is phased with them. Since each um, successive uh, electric field is generated with the polarity opposite of the preceding electrical field, the, the, that is the line of the force opposite of the oscillating electrical field produced along with the path of the travel, when the electric field with the oscillate for the magnetic field having the intensity that vary, varies directly with the electrical field with the produce the variation magnetic field, the intensity in turn produced for the electrical field, thus the two fearing fields sustain each other the resulting electromagnetic wave propagation. During the radiation process, the electric and the magnetic field are phased in time with the physically displayed for the 90 degrees in space, the various magnetic fields produce the varying electrical field, the varying with the electrical field, in turn sustain the varying magnetic field, the, uh, each field is separate reports, uh, the other neither can be propagated by itself. Figure 2 4 shows the comparison between the induction field and the radiation field. All right, your induction field shows the magnetic and the um, the um, electric field, the director of the direction of the propagation, um, radiation field, um, magnetic and uh, volt electric. Radio waves. An energy wave, the gener uh, energy wave generated with the transmitter is called the radio wave. The radio wave is radiated with the, the wave of the transmitting and intent with the very complex with energy, both with electrical and magnetic fields. Because of the combination of radio waves are referred to as electromagnetic radiation, the discussed will be um, explained with the aerosol atmosphere, the effect of the radio waves, all principles of wave motion will be discussed in chapter one and also apply with the radio waves. No, the term radio wave is not limited to the communications equipment alone. The terms apply with all the equipment that generates signal within the form of the electromagnetic energy components over the radio wave. The basic shape of the wave generated with the transmitter is that the sim wave of the wave radiated out of the space, however, the may or may not return to the retained character for the sim wave. The sim wave can um, be one cycle or many cycles. Recall with the chapter one number of the cycle of the sim wave, the complete of the one second is known of the frequency of the sim wave. The example of the 60 cycle of the ordinary house occur with each other. Uh, each second or so of the house current is said to be a frequency of the 60 cycles per second um, hertz, or 60 hertz. 
frequency falling between between um, 3,000 hertz or um, 3 kilohertz or th um, 300 gigahertz are called radio frequency radiated radio frequencies. Um, since they are commonly used with radio communication, the part of the radio frequency spectrum is divided into bands. Each of the bands is time high, higher in frequency than the only one immediate, immediately below. The arrangement of the server serves a convenient way to remember the range of the, each of the bands. The radio frequency bands are shown in Table 3.1. Using unusable for radio frequency ranges roughly 10 kilohertz to 10 gigahertz. At a frequency with a whole number of the multiple of the small basic frequency is known. Whole number multiple of the small basic frequency is known as the harmonic of the basic frequency. The basic frequency is called the first harmonic of the fourth commonly with the fundamental frequency. The frequency of the twice of the greater of the fundamental of the frequency is called the second harmonic of frequency. Three times greater than the third is, is the third harmonic, and so on. For example. Our period of radio waves is a simple amount of the time required for the completion of one full cycle. The sim wave is, um, has a frequency of 2 hertz each of the cycle. The duration period with one half cycle with a frequency of 10 hertz period with each of the cycle of one tenth of the second. Since the frequency of the radio wave the number of cycles has been completed in one second, you should be able to see that the frequency radio wave the increase of the period of the wave of the, uh, in length of the space is occupied with one full cycle of radio wave to give any given the instant rate length so expressed in meters. One meter is equal to 3.28 feet. You need to have a good understanding of the frequency wavelength to be able to select the proper intended for you for the successful communication of the relationship between the frequency wave length and antennas will be discovered in chapter 4 with the spongy velocity or speed of the radio wave radio wave radiated with the free space of the transmitting antennas to equal the speed of the light 180,000 um Miles per second, and there are 300 million um, meters per second. The base of the various factors of the baromic pressure with the humidity molecular content. Radio waves travel inside atm Earth's atmosphere at speed slightly less than the speed of light. Normally, with the discussion of the velocity, radio wave velocity referred to as the speed as which the radio travel waves travel in free space. Frequency of the radio has nothing to do with the velocity of 5 megahertz will um, travel through the space of the same velocity of the 10 megahertz wave. Um, however, the velocity of the radio waves is an important factor when making the wavelength to frequency conversion to the subject of, non um, subject of our next discussion. All right, wavelength to frequency conversion. Radio waves are offered with, um, by their wavelength of the meter of the radio than frequency. For their example, most people that have heard the commercial radio station may, um, make an announcement similar to the following station. Station WXYZ, operating at 240 meters tuned, receiving the equipment of the calibrated for the frequency of the, such a station when you first convert the design wavelength the equivalent frequency they discussed earlier. The radio wave is 3 million meters per second. Therefore, the radio wave, wave at 1 hertz would be have the travel distance of the wavelength at 300 million meters Obviously, then, at its frequency of the wave is increased to 2 hertz, the wavelength will be cut off to the 150 millimeter, um, million meters. This illustrates the principle of the higher frequency to the shorter of the wavelength. Wavelength um, frequency conversion of the radio waves are really quite simple to be covered with the wavelength of frequency reciprocal. Either one divided by the, uh, into the velocity of the radio wave yields to the other. Remember the form of the wavelength. All right, wavelength meters um, in meters is equal to the velocity of the radio wave and speed of light um, over the frequency of the radio wave in hertz, kilohertz, or megahertz. Or frequency of the radio wave is equal to the velocity of the radio wave over the wave um, length of the meters. Wavelength measure, um, meters divided in 300 million meters on frequency of the radio wave in hertz, with the likewise wing, um, wavelength of 3,000 meters frequency of the radio wave in kilohertz. This is the wavelength and divided in 300 yields, um, yield, 300 yields of megahertz. Um, now let's apply the formula to determine the frequency of the, with a, and the receiver of the equipment. It must be receiver the WXYZ operating at 240 meters. The radio wave frequency is normally expressed with the kilohertz to or megahertz. Find the frequency here with the formula is equal to um, the uh, frequency is equal to the um, wavelength. Wavelength in uh, wavelength in meters. Wavelength in meters over. Um, all right. The velocity of the radio. Velocity of the radio over the um, wavelength in meters equal to one million two hundred fifty hertz. Um, to find the frequency of the kilohertz, you have the um, three thousand over the two hundred forty meters. The um, this the frequency will give you um, frequency one point two five megahertz. Um, polarization. For the maximum absorption over the energy of the electromagnet for the reason the um, receiver of the amplitude must be located with the plane polarization plate with the conductor of the antenna right angle with the magnetic line with the force of magnet uh, moving through the antenna parallel to the electric lines cover the maximum induction. Normally the plane, plane polarization radio wave is playing with the um, plane with the electronic field 
propagates with respect for the earth. The earth is field on um, the electric field of the component with the radiated wave, wave travel through the plane, particularly with the earth's surface. The vertical, vertical radiation uh, radiation is sen- said to be vertically portalized. As shown in Figure Two Five, the view A of the um, um, electric field uh, propagates the plane parallel with the earth's surface horizontal. The radiation is said to be horizontal polarized, and shown in View B. Our vertical um, antenna wave front, earth horizontal antenna wave front. Of the position of the antenna is safe and important for the effect of the polarization of electromagnetic wave. The transmission of the antenna is close to the ground. Vertical polarized waves um, cover the great single strength with along, along the earth's surface. On the other hand, antennas high with above the ground so, um, should be hor- horizontally placed with the great possible single strength with the earth's surface. The vertical horizontal polarized antennas will be discussed in more detail. Chapter 4. Our radiated, radiated energy for the antenna is formed with the expanding sphere with a small section of the sphere of the perpendicular direction of the energy travel is called the wavefront. With all energy that on the wavefront is favored, usually all points of the wavefront are equal distance from the antenna. Therefore, the farther the wavefront is from the antenna, the less philosophical the wave appears. The dis- considerable distance of the wavefront is going to be considered plane surface at the right angle with the direction of the propagation. If you know the direction of the light, um, electric and the magnetic components, you can use the right hand rule to determine the direction of wave propagation. The rule states that the thumb and the forefinger of the middle finger right hand extends so mo- so that they are mutually perpendicular. Mil- um, middle finger will be pointed direction of the wave propagation. The thumb points of the direction of the electric field. And the four points of the direction of the magnetic field since the both, both electrical and magnetic field the reverse direction. Simultaneously propagation particular wave line is all with it, always in the same direction wave from the antenna. Alright, magnetic field, uh, electric field, magnetic field, direction of the wave propagation. Atmosphere propagation. With the atmosphere, the radio waves can be reflected, refracted, the diffracted, like light, light when a heat wave. The radio waves may be reflected with the various substance of the object, but the demeaning during and the travel between the transmitter receiving the type of the mount of the reflection depend on the reflection material. The smooth of the metal, so for the good electrical conductivity, the effect of the reflective of the radio wave, the surface of the earth itself is fairly good reflective of the radio wave is not reflected from the signal point of the reflect on the reflective, but rather it is an area of the surface. So for the area required for the reflection to take place, it depends on the wavelength of the radio wave at, the, uh, at an angle of the wave strike the re- reflecting substance. The radio waves are reflected with the flash surface of the phase shift of the alteration of the wave. The curve of the figure 2-7 shows the two radio waves uh, being deflected with the earth's surface note that they pop up the angle of the alteration of the radio waves A and B with the phase of each other with the other path toward the earth's surface. If the reflection takes place, however, the waves are approximately 180 degrees out of phase. The internal or initial ratio of the amount of the phase shift that occurs is not constant. It depends on the polarization wave, the angle of the which of the wave um, strikes the reflecting surface of the radio wave to keep the phase of the relation for the after reflection. Normally produces strong signal over the receiver this side. Um, Thus, so they refer, receive the outside out of phase to produce the waking and fading signal of the shifting given the phase relationship with the reflective waves and what major seat reason for the fading of the fading it will be discussed more later in this chapter. Phase shift of the reflected radio waves. Um, or some of the reflected radio waves. Um, refraction. Another phenomenon common to know, um, known to most of the radio wave at the beginning of the wave that they move from one medium to another with the velocity of the propagation different. Depending on waves called the refraction, for example, that's supposed to be driving down smoothly paved road with a constant speed. Suddenly, one wave goes off the, on to the shoulder off the shoulder, the car tends to veer off the one side of the chain, but the medium, the hard surface of the off shoulder, causes the change in speed, velocity, the tendency for the car, char, car to change direction. Same principle applies to the radio wave that you call the change of the curve of the medium through the end at which they are passing. Example, the radio wave shown in figure 2 8 with the traveling through the at your side, meaning for the constant speed, the wave that enters the distance of the descent layer, electrically charged iron, the parts of the wave that enter the new medium, the first travel of the faster part of the wave that have no not yet entered the new medium, the bar, bar, increase the velocity of the upper part of the wave, causes the wave to bend back to the earth of the bed, suspending chain the direction is always toward the medium, thus the lower vo- vo- velocity of the propagation. 2 H of the radio wave reflection, maximum electrical density. Radio waves passing the, through the atmosphere are collect, um, affected with certain factors such as the temperature, pressure, humidity, density. The factors can also cause the radio wave to be refracted. The effects will discover the greater later in this chapter. All right, diffraction, a radio wave that meets with an obstacle with a natural tendency to bend around with the obstacle. Illustrate figure 2 now. The bending of the diffraction result of the change of the direction part of the wave energy with the normal line of the side of the path. The change passes. Makes the passive um, most of the receiving of the energy around the edge of the obstacle shown in view A with some of the distance highest point with the obstruction shown in view B. Although diffracted radio frequency energy usually is weak, it can still be detected and suitable to receive the principal effect of the distraction and extent of the radio range beyond the visible horizon. In certain causes, use high power of low frequency radio waves can be made to encircle the Earth over that diffraction. Figure 2 9 shows the diffraction around the object transmitter side view, um, shadow zone, top view, transmitter shadow zone. Um, 
All right, the effect of the Earth atmosphere with the radio wave. The discussion of electromagnetic wave propagation is served mainly with the property of the effect of the medium located with the transmitting of the antenna with the receiver of the antenna while the radio wave travel the free um, space with little, having little out, uh, outside influence affecting the radio wave traveling with the atmosphere, Earth's atmosphere effect with the varying condition. The influence is served in the radio waves by the Earth atmosphere many of the new factors complete with the first uh, seems to be relatively simple. The um, problem of the complication, complications be, are become um, because of the lack of the uniformity of the Earth's atmosphere. The atmosphere condition vary with the change of the height of the geographical location even when then when um, even when the change within time of the day, night, and the season, year, the knowledge of the composition of the Earth's atmosphere is extremely important for the understanding of the white wave propagation. Earth atmosphere is divided in three separate regions or layers. They are the trosphere, the stratosphere, and the ionosphere. The layers of the atmosphere are illustrated in Figure 2.9. Um, ionosphere, stratosphere, and uh, troposphere um, show that the um, closest to the ionosphere is the top of the um, top of the stratosphere and the troposphere of the, uh, the Earth. Troposphere is a portion of the air's atmosphere extend with the surface of the earth to the height of the 3.7 miles at the, uh, at the North Pole and South Pole with 11.2 miles at the equator. Virtually all weather phenomena that takes place with the stratosphere, the temperature of the region, the decrease of the day, um, rapidly with the altitude of the clouds form, where they may be the turbulence because of the variation, the temperature, the density, the pressure, the conditions of great effect with the propagation of radio waves will be explained later in this chapter. Your stratosphere is located between the troposphere and the ionosphere with the temperature throughout the region. It's given there almost constant, but there is little water vapor to present. The stratosphere has very little effect of the radio wave to become the relatively calm region with little or no temperature change. Ionosphere of the ionosphere extends up over the 31.1 miles at the height of the 250 miles that it contains with a four cloud like uh, electrically charged ion that will uh, enable the radio wave to be propagated with a greater distance around the Earth. This is the most important region for the atmosphere for the longest distance point to point combination of the region. We'll discuss the detail a little later in this chapter. Radio wave transmission the two principal wa waves in electrical magnetic radio um, energy. Travel from transmitting antenna to receiving the antenna, one wave of the ground waves and the other wave sky waves. Ground waves are um, radio waves that are traveled near the surface of the Earth, surface or space waves. Sky waves are radio waves that are reflected back to the Earth from the ionosphere. So the ionosphere, sky wave, space wave, um, tower to um, surface of the wave, the space wave, sky wave. Ground waves. Ground waves is actually composed of the two separate component waves. They are known as surface waves and space waves. The determination factor of the ground wave of the component is classified in space wave or surface wave that is simple. Surface wave travels along with the surface of the Earth and space wave travels over the surface. Surface wave. The surface wave reaches the receiving side of the traveling along the surface of the ground. Shown figure 212. The surface wave can follow the contour of the Earth because of the process of the diffraction of the fraction. Surface wave meets the object with the dimension of the object does not exceed wavelength. The wave tends to curve bend and around the object. The smaller the object, the more pronounced the diffraction action occurs. If the surface wave passes over the ground, the wave induces the vulture of the earth, induces the vulture of the takes the earth energy of the wave from the source of the wave, thereby weakening the actuation of the wave that is, is moving the wave to the transmitting air to reduce the antenna of the move the um move the news vultures must be reduced. This is done by the vertical polarized wave that minimizes the extent with which the electrical field of the wave that is in contact with the earth will surface of the wave horizontally pulse electrical field which wave that is parallel with the, um, the surface of the earth of the therefore it's constantly with the contact with it, this wave that is completely attenuated with a short distance of the transmitting site. On the other hand, with the surface of the wave, the vertically polarized electrical field is the vertical to the Earth and the morally dips in, in and out of the Earth's surface. For this reason, the vertical polarization is very superior to the horizontal position, polarization of the surface wave propagation. Or right, the actuation of surface wave to undergo for the uh, induced voltage also depends on the electrical property of terrain with the, over the which wave to travel the best type of the surface is one with a good electricity conductor with a better conductive glass with the actuation table 2 2 gave the relatively conductive various surface of the weather earth um seawater good fall flaming um flatty loamy soil flare large body of the water, fresh water fair rocky terrain poor desert poor jungle un unusable all right. Another major factor of the actuation of the, of the of this frequency recall the earlier discussion wavelength of the higher frequency of the radio wave. The shorter the um the higher frequency of the radio wave, the shorter the wavelength will be. Therefore, the higher frequency, the shorter wavelengths are normally detract the beat, but are absorbed by the Earth by, by points relatively close to the range mission site. You assume that therefore the frequency of the surface of the wave is increased more rapidly. But the surface of the wave will be absorbed that is attenuated by the Earth because of the attention with the surface of the wave is impractical with the long distance transmission frequency of the two megahertz. On the other hand, the frequency of the surface of the wave is long enough that very long wavelength the Earth appears the very small. But the differentiation um, diffraction is sufficient, but the propagation will be bend beyond the high horizon. Beyond the horizon, in fact, lowering transmitting frequency very low frequency range using high power transmitters of surface of the um, wave can be propagated greater just the navy's extreme high powered v um, VLF transmitters are actually capable of transmitting surfaces uh, or very low frequency transmitters are actually transmitting surfaces with wave signals around the earth and can provide coverage within the naval units operating anywhere in the sea at the sea. 
All right, space wave. Space wave power with the two distinct paths of the transmitting antenna with the receiving the antenna with that one with the way it one through air directly receive the antenna, the other reflect with the ground with the receiving the antenna the shoot of the year two thirteen. The primary path of the space wave is directly with the transmission. And the transmitting antenna, the receiver of the antenna, so the receiver of the antenna must be located with, with the radio horizon and transmitting area between the space of the refracted slightly, even with the whole propagated with the tra troposphere with the radio horizontal horizons actually one third of the rare that farther than the line of sight with the natural horizon. All right, 213 shows the space wave propagation transmitting antenna, direct path, reflected path, receiving the antenna. Although space waves um, suffer literal ground and actuation, the nether lifts are suspected to fade and become the space waves actually follow, follow two paths with a different length. The direct path of the ground and the reflected path. The receiving the inside of the rare form may arrive in and out of phase. The two components of the waves are received in phase. Uh, in phase. The result will reinforce the stronger signal likewise. They are received out of the phase and they tend to cancel one another out, which resolve the weaker fading signal. Or your sky wave. The sky wave, often um, called the isophonic uh, ionosphere wave, is related, um, related with the upward, downward, uh, upward direction. To re um, the sky wave is often called the isotronic wave, that is related with the upward direction. Return to the Earth to some of the distance located location because of the refraction of the uh, refraction of the ionosphere. The form of the propagation is relatively um, relatively unaffected by the, by the Earth's that can propagate signals over the greater distance. Usually the high frequency band due to the sky wave propagation that they follow in the depths of the, of the ionosphere. The effect of the, uh, the effect of the sky waves will help to determine will help you to better understand the nature of the sky wave propagation. All right, structure of the ionosphere. Um, the state with either the ionosphere or the region of the atmosphere that extends about 30 miles above the surface of the Earth to about 250 miles approximately named the ionosphere because it is considered of several layers of the electrically charged gas items called ions. These ions are formed by a process called ionization. All right, ionization of the curve of the high energy, the ultraviolet light the wave of the sun enters the ionosphere, but the region of the atmosphere strikes with the gas atom, the, uh, literally knocking the electron free with the pattern of the parent atom. Normal, uh, nor normal atom is electronically neutral since, of the, uh, since it consists of the positive proton and nucleus, but negative are orbiting an electron. The negative electron is knocked free with the atom, the atom becomes positively charged with the color of the positive ion, and remains space along with the free electron and the negative charge for the process of the up upsetting the electrical. Neutrality is known by the ionization. Free negative electrons substantially absorb the ultraviolet energy with the in initially fed through um, them from the atoms. The ultraviolet light wave continue with the positive, um, produce positive ions or negative electron uh, negative electrons. Since the increase because of the absorption of the energy, free electron of the ionized layer is formed. The rate of the ionization occurs with depending on the density of the atoms of the atmosphere. Intensity of the ultraviolet light wave related to um, the activity of the sun. So of the atmosphere bombardment, ultraviolet lights um, wave the different ultra uh, different frequencies. Several of the ionized layer that um, form a different altitude as low frequency ultraviolet waves penetrate atmosphere. At least, therefore, pro um, produce the ionized layer with the higher altitudes. Conversely, ultraviolet waves the higher frequency penetrate the deeper and produce layers in the lower altitudes. It's an important factor to determine the density of the ionized layer with the evaluation elevation angle of the sun with the change frequency, the region for the height and thickness of the ionized layer vary depending on the time of the day, or the even the season of the year. All right. Uh, recombination. Recall the process of the ionization involved with the ultraviolet wave knocking electrons free. But then the atom reverse pro um, process is called recombination. Recomb with the free electron pop of the ion ions collide with each other. The sense of the collection they are inevitable. Positive ions return to the original natural atom state. The recombination process also depends on the time of the day between the hour of the early morning and later afternoon. Rate of the ionization exceeds the rate of the recombination during the period of the ionization. Limit. Um, layer, layers reached with the greater density and the external maximum influence of the radio wave during later afternoon and the earlier evening hours. However, the radio of the recombination conceived of the radio of the ionization, the density of the ionized layers become, begins to decrease throughout the night and density increases, continues to decrease reaching low, low points of the, just before sunrise. All right, your four distinct layers. Ionosphere is composed of the three layers of the, uh, designated D, E, and F, the lowest level to the highest level, um, the low, lowest level to the highest level. Shown in figure 214, the F layer is further divided into two layers of the F1 lower layer and F2 higher layer. They are present the absence of these layers of the ion sphere over there. The height they above the Earth are varied the position of the sun. The height and the high new radiation ion sphere directly above the given point with the greatest of the at night is minimum. The radiation is removed in many of the particles of where ionization re recombine. Time of the interval between the condition of fine but the position of the normal or number of the ionized layer of the ion sphere change. The sense of the position of the sun varies daily, daily monthly, yearly with respect to the specified point on the Earth's exact point. Position with the number of the layers present will be extremely difficult to determine. However, the following general statements can be made. 214 shows the layers of the ion sphere on the F layer, light and day, F2 layer 160, 250 miles, the F1 layer 100 miles, the E on um, the 
um, electric layer and the E layer and the D layer, um, 59 miles and 30, 30 to 50 miles. All right, the D layer ranges about 30 to 55 miles. Ionization of the D layer has become the, the lowest region in the ionized ionosphere, but the layer is about the refract track signal for the low frequency. The high frequencies ride, pass right through the attenuated the fact after the sum of the D layers disappear because of the rap, rapid recombination of the ions. All right, the E layer limits about 50 to 5 to 90 miles. The layer is known to the can, can only have a side of the layer because of the two men that were first to prop, propose its extent, ex existence. The rate of the ionic recombination layer is rapidly after some of the layer is almost gone by midnight. The layer's ability to refract signal, um, signals is as high as 20 megahertz for this reason and is valuable for communication ranges up to 1,500 miles. The F layer exists at 90 to 240 miles during the daylight hour. The F layer separates the two layers of F1 and F2. The ionization level of the layers, uh, layers are quite high, very widely during the day. At nor noon, the portion of the atmosphere is close to the sum of the degree of the ionization maximum. The, since the atmosphere is ratified by the height of the recombination curve, the slowly after sunlight, there are fairly kind of, the ionized layers always present. The F layers are responsible for the high frequency long distance transmission. Or refraction of the ion, ion, ion sphere. A refraction in the ionosphere with the radio wave the time of the ionized layer the refraction bang with the wave of the curve that we discussed earlier. The refraction is with the abrupt change of the velocity of the upper part of the radio wave strike at the end of the new medium the amount of the refraction of the curve depending on the three main factors of the density of the ionization layer the frequency of the radio wave the, and the angle of the width of the wave enter the layer. All right, density of the layer. Figure 215 illustrates the relation between radio waves and ionization density of the ionization layer, um, central region of the relatively dense ionization, which chapters off the intensity of the both above the below the maximum region. Radio waves enter the region and increase the ionization, increase the velocity of the upper part of the wave, the call of the Tibetan and the tour of the earth. While the wave is highly dense for the center port of the wave, however, the refraction and curve of the more so, maybe because of the density of the ionization is almost uniform. The wave enters the upper part of the layer, the decreasing the ionization velocity, the upper part of the wave, the decrease of the wave has been away from the earth. So the decreasing ionization, maximum ionization, increasing ionization, transmitter site and to receiver site. If you, we strike within and with a very high ionization layer, the wave may have bent back and so rapidly that it appeared to have the reflect, refracted instead of refracted by back to Earth. The reflective of the radio wave's highly ionized layer must be approximately no thicker than one wavelength of the radio wave. Since the ionized layers are often several miles thick, the ion, ion, ion spheric relationship is more likely to occur with the longer wavelengths. All right, frequency. For any given any, any time, the ion, ion spheric layer maximum frequency of the which radio waves can be transmitted vertically or refracted back to Earth. The frequency is known by the critical frequency in terms of which we have the here. Here, the frequency of any discussion radio wave propagation radio waves transmitted the frequency higher than critical frequency given the layer will pass through the layer, but there will be a loss in the space of the same wave, the upper layer with a higher critical frequency. This will be refracted back to Earth. Radio wave with the frequency lower, but the critical frequency will also be refracted back to Earth unless they absorb and have been refracted. And lower, lower, lower frequency with the radio wave more rapidly will wave of the refractively given the degree of the ionization figure 216 show the three separate wave of the different frequencies enter and ionization level the same angle with the note of the 5 megahertz wave the refracted quite simply the 20 megahertz refracted less sharply return to earth a greater distance the 100 megahertz obviously greater the critical frequency ionization layer therefore not refracted into the um, bat but but passed into space so you have ionization mega 5 megahertz 20 megahertz 100 megahertz angle of the incident incidence the rate of which of the wave, given the frequency reflected by the ionization layer, but it depends on the angle of the which of the angle of the layer of the figure 217 show of the radio wave with the same frequency enter the layer with a different angle of the angle of the A. The angle which A strike with the layer is not vertically from the wave of the refractive of the earth as wave of the angle of the layer the bent slightly but, but path through the layer is in the loss of the wave to reduce the angle of the less of the vertical wave B strikes the layer and related um, refracted back to the angle of the wave B is called the critical angle of the axe particular frequency of the wave wave. Any wave that leaves the antenna at an angle greater than the critical angle it will penetrate the ionosphere with four frequency, then be lost in space. Wave C struck with the ice on your with a small angle of the which of the wave can be refracted and still return to the earth. At a smaller angle, the wave will be refracted and will not return to earth. Alright, so for the critical wave, the ionosphere, um, the frequency of the radio wave, the creep of the critical angle must be reduced for the refraction of the curve. They illustrate the figure 218 when the 2 megahertz wave strike for the layer of the critical angle of the frequency refracted back to Earth. Although the 5 megahertz wave broken line strike for the ionosphere lesser angle, the nevertheless penetrate of the layer and loss is lost. The angular is lowered and the vertical, however, the critical angle of the 5 megahertz is where the reach of the wave that is refracted back to Earth. 
All right, show the critical angle with a megahertz on your 500 megahertz non-refracted ionization critical angle with a ground wave, and also um, your skip distance and skip zone. Figure 219, know the relationship between the sky wave and skip distance. Skip zone over the ground wave covered to the skip zone. Distance is the distance for the transmitter to the point where the skip wave is first returned to Earth. The size of the skip distance depends on the frequency of the wave and the angle and incidence and the degree of the ionization present. Um, show the um, figure 219's relationship to the skip zone, skip distance, ground wave. Um, show the ground wave, cover the sky, w sky wave, skip distance, um, skip distance, skip zone, ionization freeze, skip wave, wave coverage. Or right, skip zone is the zone of the silence between the point of the ground and the bit wave to become the two weak with the reception point with the sky wave is first return to the earth side of the skip zone that depends on the extent of the ground wave coverage of the skip distance. The ground wave the coverage is great enough for the skip distance short enough for the no zone silence curve there is no skip zone. Occasionally the first sky wave will return to the earth within the range of the ground wave if the sky wave the ground wave nearly equal intensity with the sky wave alternately reinforced with the cancel of the ground wave the cause of the severe fading. This is called the fade the difference between the two waves the resulting in longer path travel by the sky wave. Propagation path. The path of the refractive wave will allow the receiver to depend on the angle to which the wave strikes for the ionization ion fear. The um show it should be remembered that however the radio frequency energy radio of the transmitting antenna spreads out with that, with distance. Without spreads out with the distance. Um the energy through therefore strikes the ionization fear of many different angles rather than a single angle. After the re radio frequency energy of the ra uh, given the frequency energy of the ionic region, the path is of that this energy might flow as any uh, flow any or many. And it may reach the receiving antenna for two or more paths of the single layer, and it also may also reach the receiving antenna over the path involving more than one layer, multiple hops between the ion sphere of the Earth and any other combination of these paths. Figure 220 shows the how the radio waves will may reach the rece receive the vibe of the receivable path of the one layer with the various angle the various angle of the radio frequency energy strike with the layer represented by the dark lines designated the rays one through six. All right, figure 220 shows the rays of the frequency varying angle of the incident transmitter um, one, two, three, four. Five, um, six. Skip distance and receiver. When the angle is relatively low with respect to the horizon of the ray one, but the or only side with the penetrate for the layer of the propagation of the path of the angle, the incident of the increase of the rays two and three with the pe rays penetrate the deeper and long layer of the range of the three with these rays that decrease the a certain angle of the reach for the ray three with the penetration layer of the ray ray, ray of the refraction such for the first return of the earth at the minimal distance of the transmitter. Notice, however, that the ray three still manages to um, reach the receiving site on the second refraction at the uh, at called the hop of the ionosphere. Um, Angle will increase until more than three rays four and five of the radio frequency energy penetrate with the center air of the maximization layer of the rays refractive the ray rather slowly eventually return to the either great distance and at angle to approach vertical this incidence um ray, ray six of the ray is not returned at all but pass it through all the layers. Alright, um All right, absorption in the ionosphere. The main factor of the effect of the radio wave is the path between the transmitting and receiving the sides as the factor of the greatest reverse of the effect of the radio wave absorption. Absorption results in the loss of the energy radio wave, the pronounced effect of the bulk of the strength of the radio signal and the ability to communicate over long distances. You learn that in section of the ground wave, the source of the wave, the source of the remote of the absorption, the loss of the becoming over the ground, induced voltage of the sky waves, on the other hand, suffer, the most, um, suffer most of the absorption loss to recover the condition of the ionosphere. Know that some of the absorption of the sky waves must also occur with the lower atmospheric level between the presence of water and water vapor. However, it becomes important with the frequency of the 10,000 10, megahertz. But the ionization atmosphere occurs with the low reach of the ionization ionosphere with the ionization with the density of the greater of the radio wave path of the ionosphere with the loss of some of the energy free electron with the line of the these of high energy free electrons ions do not collide with the gas molecules low energy most of the energy lost by radio wave is reconverted electromagnetic energy of the wave continues to probably be complicated with the chain of the intensity how with the high energy free electrons ions do not collide with the other particles much for the energy loss result in the uh, absorption of the energy from the wave but since the absorption of the energy depends on the collision and practical particle with the greater Density of the ion is layered, greater probability of the collision, therefore the greater absorption. The higher dense, um, density of the D and E layers provide the greatest absorption of the radio waves. All right, because of the ab, um, ab amount of the, of the absorption of the sky wave, depending on the density of the ion sphere, over the very for the sensible and sun seasonal daily conditions, um, the, and it's impossible to express the field um, fixed relationship between the distance and the signal strength of the ion sphere propagation under a certain subcondition absorption of the energy is so great that communicating over the distance is beyond light, uh, line of sight the difficult. All right, fading. The most troublesome, frustrating problem in the receiving of the radio signal is the variation signal the strength of the most commonly known is fading. The simple condition that can be produced of fading the radio wave reflected, refracted from the ionosphere of reflected the air of the random chamber. The polarization of the wave may occur the vertical horizontal amount of the receiving the antenna are designed to receive. You want me to cook that steak before it's ruined? Yeah. 
A vertical and horizontal mounted receiving antenna is designed to receive the vertical horizontal polarized wave. That respectively, therefore, the change in polarization cover the change to receive the level, the signal level to become the inability of the antenna to receive polarization changes. Our fading also results in the absorption of the radio frequency with the eyes on so fear with the absorption of the fading occurs with the long period with the other type of the fade, um, fading since the absorption takes proper place slowly. Usually, however, the fading ion sphere of the circle this may result with a multi-path propagation. All right, I'm going to cut the tape there. Uh,